Today's video is a simple hair growth oil recipe that will help you to grow back your bald spots. It's amazing for thinning hair. It's also amazing for scalp issues. So if you're suffering from any scalp issues, such as dandruffs, itchy scalp, flaky scalp, then this oil is definitely for you. I'm going to show you guys one way in which you can incorporate this magical hair growth oil into your hair care routine. I'm also going to explain all the ways in which you can use this oil to promote hair growth, treat your scalp and maintain overall healthy hair. If you're new to my channel, hi, welcome. In this channel, I do DIY videos that can help you to grow your hair using natural ingredients. And if you enjoy this video, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. So if you're interested, you know what to do. Grab a seat and let's get into it. The first ingredient that I'm going to be adding is basil. So I'm going to go ahead and wash my ingredient. Then I'm going to go ahead and remove the excess water from the ingredient with a paper towel. If you want your oil to last for a very long time, make sure to remove the excess water from the ingredient because oil and water do not mix together well and your oil is going to go bad really easily. Basil helps to improve scalp condition. It stimulates hair follicles. This amazing natural ingredient is packed with nutrients like vitamin A, C, iron and calcium which are extremely important for healthy hair growth a study showed that basil can also help to treat hair loss encourage hair growth and promote production of a new healthy hair as well the next ingredient that i'm going to be adding is mint leaves again i just repeat the same process i wash the mint leaves then i use the paper towel to remove the excess water from the ingredient. Mint leaves helps to promote hair growth. It helps to prevent hair fall. It's also amazing for scalp issues such as dandruffs and egg lice. The health of your scalp is extremely important as we all know our hair grow from the scalp. So if you're trying to grow a healthy, strong hair, it's very important that you keep your scalp as healthy as it can be. Because as I mentioned before, our hair grow from the scalp and you want your scalp to be healthy for a new hair growth. So I went ahead and add my mint leaves into the blender. The next ingredient that I'm going to be adding is avocado oil. Avocado is rich in vitamins and fatty acid. Not only does it help to nourish the scalp, but also helps to keep your hair looking healthy, shiny, hydrated, and it's also sealing moisture to your hair as well. It reduces dandruffs and prevents hair breakage. So for the measurement of the oil, I'm going to be adding half cup of avocado oil. The next oil that I'm going to be adding is grapeseed oil. I'm going to go ahead and also add half cup of grapeseed oil. Grapeseed oil helps to promote scalp and healthy hair. It adds shine to your hair. It hydrates your hair. It's soft in split end, it's strengthening hair strand, and it also protect your hair from sun damage. Once I'm done adding all my ingredients, I went ahead and blend everything together. So guys, if you guys are still watching to this point, and if you enjoy watching, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. So once I'm done blending all the ingredients together, this is how it looks like. I'm going to go ahead and transfer it to the pot. Then I'm going to transfer the pot to the stove. I'm going to allow the ingredient to slowly cook for about 30 minutes on a low heat. I'm also going to go ahead and add fresh rosemary leaves. So you guys know I love, love rosemary leaves. It's one of my favorite natural ingredients to use because of its amazing benefit. You can also use dry rosemary leaves as well, but I would suggest always use the fresh rosemary leaves. You can purchase your fresh rosemary leaves from your local supermarket. Rosemary is amazing when it comes to stimulating hair growth, reducing hair fall, 
it also helps to reduce scalp inflammation it helps to stimulate blood supply to the hair follicles and it strengthen your hair as well i'm also going to go ahead and add two tablespoons of coconut oil coconut oil could help you to grow your hair longer by moisturizing your hair and reducing hair breakage it protects your hair from protein loss it also helps to soften and condition your hair it adds shine to your hair and stimulates hair growth by nourishing the scalp and helps to remove buildup from your hair follicles. So as I mentioned before, make sure the stove is on the lowest heat because you don't want to destroy all the amazing benefits that contain in the ingredient and the oil. You can also do the double boiler method or you can also do the 24 hours to 48 hours infusion. Pick whatever method that works best for you. Also remember that you don't have to use the same oil that I'm using in this video. What works for me might not work for you. So you need to know exactly what oil that works for your hair type, okay? You need to know what oil that your hair loves. It's not everyone that loves using coconut oil or grapeseed oil. So just use whatever your hair loves. So after 30 minutes on a low heat, this is how it looks like. So once the oil is ready, you will definitely know. If you guys notice, the rosemary leaves has changed color from bright green to darker green, which means that the rosemary has infused correctly into the oil. So I'm going to go ahead and off the stove. I'm going to allow the oil to cool down for a few minutes before separating the oil from the ingredient. After cooling down, this is how it looks like. I'm going to go ahead and straighten it out. Once I'm done straining, this is how it looks like. Look at that color. The color is given. It's amazing. It's everything. And it smells amazing as well. I'm going to go ahead and add two tablespoons of Jamaican black castor oil. Jamaican black castor oil improves blood circulation to the scalp, thereby encouraging hair growth. It also helps to nourish the scalp and strengthen the hair root thereby treating thinning hair so if you have thinning hair or your hair is very damaged i would suggest try to incorporate jamaican black castor oil or castor oil into your hair care routine the last ingredient that i'm going to be adding is vitamin e oil vitamin e oil helps to support healthy scalp and hair it helps to prevent hair breakage there are so many ways in which you can use vitamin E oil to grow your hair extremely fast. I went ahead and add two tablespoons of vitamin E oil into the oil. So at this point, I just went ahead and mix everything together. Then I'm going to go ahead and transfer the oil into my applicator bottle for easy use. So if you're a big fan of essential oil, you can also go ahead and add your essential oil. You can add any essential oil of your choice. You can add essential oil such as lavender, cloves, rosemary, tea tree, peppermint. Just add any essential oil of your choice. So if you guys are still watching this video to this point, I hope you guys are enjoying this video. Make sure to watch this video to the end so you don't miss any useful information. So this is how the oil looks like. It looks amazing. I'm going to go ahead and add dry rosemary leaves into the oil. I'm going to go ahead and leave the dry rosemary leaves into the oil to infuse further. So now I'm going to show you guys how to use this oil to promote a healthy hair and scalp and to boost hair growth as well. So basically I just went ahead and applied the oil to their edges and their scalp. Scalp massage is very important when it comes to hair growth. It's very important to massage your scalp as this helps to promote hair growth. 
so if you're experiencing hair breakage on your edges or if your edges are pulling out due to the protective style you can also apply this oil to your edges massage it in every night you will definitely see a massive improvement on your edges so i went ahead and massaged the oil to the scalp for about five minutes scalp massage is very important because it helps to stimulate hair growth it increases blood flow to the scalp which lead to hair growth i would suggest you should always massage your scalp every other night for about five to ten minutes you can also apply this oil to your edges as well if you're experiencing hair loss on your edges your crown section and the back of your hair apply this oil to those areas every other night also don't forget to massage it in as well i also love using this oil as a hot oil treatment so if you're not a big fan of applying oil to your scalp you can also use this oil as a hot oil treatment as well so what you want to do is make sure to warm the oil using the double boiler method please do not use microwave as this will destroy all the amazing benefits that contain in the oil if you want to see a quicker result you need to be consistent consistency is the key consistency is what is going to give you the hair you're looking for if you're not consistent i'm sorry guys you're not going to see results you're not going to see thickness in your hair you're not going to retain length so do give this oil a go and give it time to work so between two weeks you're going to start to experience less breakage and less shedding the more you use the oil the more you start to see hair growth the more you start noticing your hair is getting thicker your hair is getting fuller and you will start to retain length so if you want to see a dramatic result be consistent consistency is the key so as you guys can see the hair looks super healthy and shiny so guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below if you have any question for me. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.